you know, geology matters with existing operating plants, but geology matters also with repository siting, for instance, that kind of thing. Um, but the, the back end of the fuel cycle is broader than that, and probably many of you are aware that we are now dealing with the waste confidence decision um, uh, judgment and ruling out of the circuit court now at the, uh, at the NRC. And I'm not able to say a lot about this because it's an active adjudicatory matter, but let me just say that we know this is a pressing issue. It's a priority for us at the commission. We are now at the commission level looking at a staff uh, document which is laying out some options for going forward. We will deal with that promptly and we will have a plan to move forward quickly. So that's, that's sort of where we're going with, the, with that and, and there will be other issues that will come up as well. Um, I think especially out of Fukushima we're also paying more attention to spent nuclear fuel and issues associated with that. And then my fourth and final um, goal for, for the agency is to improve communication. Uh, an agency like ours, an independent regulator, doesn't do well with the public and ensure public, instill public confidence unless we communicate well. And my, you know, my initial impression is, uh, of reading NRC documents, is that some of them are rather opaque. <laughs> And they're full of acronyms um, that are really difficult to figure out. Um, there's no LOA, no list of acronyms associated with them. Um, yeah. It's funny, when I say LOA to people at the NRC, nobody knows what I'm talking about. Wow, it's an acronym. You don't, you know, don't have a clue. So, um, so anyway, I've been, uh, I've, I've, every time I get an opportunity to talk to the staff, I've been emphasizing this to them. I think it's important both internally and externally for us to be much more transparent with our communications. You know, I read these documents and I sit there and I imagine a grandmother who lives near a nuclear power plant trying to, you know, slog through some of these documents to understand what some of the issues are. And I, I just wring my hands. It's like I think about grandmothers trying to open bottle tops sometimes when I can't open them, you know. How do they get the bottle top open? I don't know. Um, so, uh, so anyway, we need to make sure that we communicate effectively with the public so that the public can have confidence in our work. Oh. <laughs> That's another very important area of focus for us. And, you know, there are, there are a number of issues that will come up at plants, that have come up at plants. We will continue to, to maintain our focus on that. I've been very impressed with the staff at the NRC. They are a strong group of people, um, happy to debate the issues, and, uh, and I'm convinced that their main goal is also ensuring public health and safety.